One day closer to Halloween around Texas, there are a lot of encounters with the unknown and stories that go along with them. Haunted hotels, haunted houses, even supposedly haunted bridges. On Friday, we told you about Woman Hollering Creek, and this morning we're talking about Donkey Lady Bridge, which I haven't even heard of. Our Max Massey and producer, Joy Presley and Carlos Hernandez, wanted to check it out for themselves. They wanted shattered windshields, hoof prints, and nay. Welcome to Donkey Lady Bridge, a ghost story that goes back decades. The lady was badly burnt in a fire, and she was distorted, and her hands became almost to look like hoofs, and they were heavily scarred, and her face was elongated, and she sort of looked like a horse. Throughout the years, many visitors here have told the story of seeing this woman or seeing this beast, but like the supposed encounters, there's more than one story about how this haunting began. She was coming across the bridge here with her donkey. Her donkey had attacked and hurt a little boy earlier or something along that line. The father came out here, the little boy. He caught the lady and the donkey going across the bridge. Rumor has it that woman and her donkey were pushed off the bridge and died. Then her spirit never left. But that's what it just may be, a rumor. The kid's out here. Then after a while, one of the uncles took a, a, a horseshoe and he put it on a long rod and they'd sneak up and they'd pick an old beater and they'd shake it and they'd slam that horseshoe into it. It may have been kids who spread the story, but if you take a look around, it still doesn't look like it's somewhere you want to be when the sun goes down. Here. When it gets darker out here, you're going to have experiences out here on your own because it's definitely creepy. Be careful when you come out here. Max Massey, KSAT 12 News.